Hey everybody! Today I want to show you how you can use Liplytics Traffic Light Visual for Power BI for visualizing your project status or any other kind of status indication. Before we will start, let's take a look at my dashboard and the corresponding data. You can see that I'm currently working on a project management status report. The project status information are represented by values like green, yellow, and red. I would like to use Liblitics Traffic Light Visual to visualize these values in a simple traffic light color logic. Therefore, I transformed the string values into simple number values like 1, 2, and 3. Green is represented by 1, yellow is represented by 2, and red is represented by 3. If you would like to know how you can transform your data this way, please read the article on our website. You can find the link in the video's description below. So, let's get started. First of all, we need to download the visual from Microsoft App Source. Therefore, we need to open up Power BI Desktop or Service. Click on the three dots on the right-hand side under Visualizations and select Get more visuals. Search for traffic light in the corresponding search field. You can see that our visual is officially certified by Microsoft. This means that it meets the highest security standards of Microsoft and is able to be exported to PDF and PowerPoint. Click on the traffic light icon and download the visual for free by clicking the Add button. The installed visual will appear on the right-hand side under Visualizations. To get started, simply select the visual from the list. An empty instance of the visual will appear on your dashboard. Now let's add our measure to it. I will choose the status cost number measure. You can see that the traffic light will be shown. As you remember, I transformed my text values into number measures. To make the visual indicate the right color to our measure values, we need to define the ranges in the format pane on the right hand side. Let's click on ranges and define our ranges. I would like to see the traffic light indicating green when the measure value is 1. So I define the range to start at 1 and end at 1. I will do the same for the yellow range, which has the value 2. For the red range, I select 3. You can now see that the traffic light indicates the color yellow. The color yellow is represented by the value 2. So right now I can replace my table with my traffic light. Let me quickly apply these changes to all of my status information. So, you can now see that I replaced all my tables with the traffic light visual. Since the project information differ from project to project, you can see the traffic light changing its color when I filter on a specific project. Perfect, we are done. The traffic light visual works as expected. To learn more tips and tricks about our products for Power BI and ClickSense, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.